Hello Harry Potter fans, Peter Kenneth here. Welcome back to the Potter Collector channel where we are a community of collectors. This is going to be my largest Harry Potter book unboxing ever. And it's probably the largest Harry Potter book unboxing on YouTube or the internet or ever done. You ready to see the stack of packages? I am going to be unboxing all of these books right now. This is going to be insane! Well, that was fun. If you have any questions about Harry Potter, just kidding! I haven't opened anything yet. I have my new oak wand that I got at Wizarding World of Harry Potter. I won this wand for uh, my costume, my Albus Dumbledore costume, which you can see right here. One of the Ollivander's originals that you can purchase at the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. And in honor of opening so much Harry Potter book mail, I'm wearing my Half-Blood Prince shirt from Out of Print. I guess the only way to start is to start. This is from Spain. This is Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone in Catalan with the Pottermore cover, very beautiful. Nice shiny detail. Here's the back, very simple. It is a paperback and uh, very, very pretty. Let's grab something from this side now. Uh-oh, I'm seeing some damage! Oh no. Ay -ay -ay. where are these from? Amazon. Poop on a stick. These are the paperback Catalan editions. Goblet of Fire got a little bent. Um, but here's Goblet of Fire, paperback edition Catalan. Chamber of Secrets, paperback Catalan. Deathly Hollows, paperback Catalan. And Prisoner of Azkaban, paperback Catalan. And then also the Pottermore cover in Catalan. A Prisoner of Azkaban. I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna do about these, see if I can fix the books at all. Maybe they'll just flatten out. But if not, I'm gonna have to return them. I'm gonna bring you guys a little closer. Too close! Okay. Wait. Nope. Oh. And tilt and... Hey. Here we have something. Let's see what's in here. Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows in Spanish. Paperback. I have the hardcovers. Need the paperbacks. All right, let's uh, summon another package over. Accio package. All right. What, you're saying you saw a hand somewhere? Uh, no, a hand was not holding this package. It was Inside we have Chinese in paperback with the Kazu covers. And I don't know why I received Galician Half-Blood Prince because I have Galician Half-Blood Prince. I have to look back and see what I ordered because they sent me the wrong book. Ah uh, yes, that can sometimes happen. Next up, this is, oh. <gasps> I'm so excited about this book. And I found the the fourth one too. The, well, actually it's the third book, but the fourth of the set. I am a Happy Potter collector. I'm gonna be saying that a lot in this video probably. This is the adult edition in Swedish of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. I have Chamber of Secrets and Goblet of Fire. I needed Philosopher's Stone and Prisoner of Azkaban, they only printed those four in Swedish. So it's possible that Prisoner of Azkaban is in this pile, but here is Philosopher's Stone. It took me probably six months or more of waiting for this book, and it finally showed its face, and now it's here in the Potter Collector Library. Ah. Alrighty, we have uh, another package. Um, this is uh, Goblet of Fire in paperback. Spanish and paperback, Goblet of Fire. Uh, funny story about this book. So one of you had gifted me Philosopher's Stone in this paperback edition in uh, Spanish, right here. And when I went to England, I went to Foils, which is a massive bookstore in England, and purchased two through seven of the paperbacks in Spanish. But I purchased the wrong edition. So look at the spine on this one. I accidentally got these editions, so they don't really match. So since I got all of these, I had to get Philosopher's Stone in this edition and then still find the remaining six books in this paperback edition. So I found them all. 
Here is Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. The others are probably in this pile, but that's my little story about these uh, Spanish editions. All right, this is, looks like a double, a double whammy. Oh, yes, 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 yes. These are Finnish, the Finnish adult editions. In paperback, I'm gonna open up the others first. Once again, a very happy Potter collector. Here is Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone or Sorcerer's Stone in Finnish, the adult paperback edition. They're gonna be out of order, but here's Prisoner of Azkaban, Goblet of Fire, Order of the Phoenix, Half-Blood Prince, they're friends, Chamber of Secrets, and last but not least, book number seven, Deathly Hallows. And next up is... Ah, this is the paperback Spanish edition that I was missing of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Someone asked me on Instagram today, actually, what's better, hard covers or soft covers? And I told them both. Collect both if you can, and if you can't, collect hard covers. Although some people collect paperbacks and prefer paperbacks, um, which isn't a bad thing. I prefer everything, but if I were to have to choose, I would choose hard covers over paperbacks. What is this? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <gasps> this, I don't know what it is. It's a book Book club edition of some kind, um, Chamber of Secrets book club edition that I have never seen before in this color variation. Check this out. So book club editions uh, were a lesser quality material. They were sold in, through a book, book club, Scholastic Book Club. And Chamber of Secrets, I have never seen this color variation. Philosopher's Stone, we see maroon and black boards. We see solid red boards and we see solid black boards. Oh, there's one more. We see solid black boards in small size as well. But I have never seen this variation of the Chamber of Secrets book club edition. Unfortunately, it doesn't have its dust jacket, but very cool. Isn't this cool, the color combination? Now, when it comes to Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, the first printing, book club editions have the number line, the same number line as the rare first printing that everyone wants in their collection. So, uh, in the past, we've seen a lot of counterfeits of Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Check out the video right here if you are looking to purchase a first printing and you're not quite sure and a little scared about finding a counterfeit one. One of the things counterfeiters do is they take the copyright page from a book club edition and insert it into a trade edition and make it look like it's a first printing when it could be a later printing, like a fourth printing or something like that. But one easy way to determine if this has occurred is looking at the paper quality paper is a lot thinner on a book club edition. Here is an example. Look at that. You can see through to the other side, whereas the, the normal trade edition, it's a lot thicker paper. And while if you shine bright light on it, you can see through it, it's a lot more difficult and you don't see as much. There are so many Harry Potter books out there that collectors haven't, haven't seen. And it's crazy when you come across something that you've never seen before, and I was very excited to uh, be able to snag this. All right, this next package is from a friend of mine, from Carly at All The Pretty Books. We did a trade, and she helped me acquire a book that I didn't have yet. Very cool, it is the first edition of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone in Portuguese. A fair amount of translations released books, the first edition books, uh, Philosopher's Stone and sometimes uh, Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets with different cover art than the American covers or the British covers. And then in the second edition, maybe you know when book three and four were being released, they switched to either the American or the British covers. This happened with a lot of translations but you can still find some first editions in different languages with different cover art. European Portuguese, for example, you can find Philosopher's Stone with this cover art before they switched to the American Mary Grand Prix cover art, and also Chamber of Secrets with this cover art. All right, let's open one of the bigger boxes. Big box for Ron. All right, this is from Mongolia. This is the first time that Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire has been published in Mongolian. So this is exciting because it's a brand new translation, something that's never been released before or translated before in Mongolian. So I got a big box of them. Some of them are for some friends, some of them are to resell. Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire in Mongolian. How cool is that? It's a brand new translation. Here is the back of the book. They of course use the Johnny Duddle artwork. Here are six Mongolian Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire books. This is so fun. I'm glad I get to share it with all of you. 
This is a paperback, probably Spanish. I'm gonna guess it's Spanish, but I could be wrong. Um, correct. It's, oh, it's two. I already have a Philosopher's Stone in Spanish, so I don't know why I purchased or accidentally purchased another one, but it's uh, Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone in Spanish and Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban in Spanish, those paperbacks. Ta-da! So this extra will probably go into a future Potter Collector book sale. I do book sales randomly on Instagram, and they usually all sell out within a day. So turn on your Instagram notification bell so that you don't miss a book sale if you are interested in any of these books. But this will go into a future Potter Collector Instagram book sale. Looks like all the small packages are done, and only the big box for Ron packages are left. Oh, fun, fun, fun in the sun. So these three books here complete my hardcover original Dutch books. So we have uh, Prisoner of Azkaban and Philosopher's Stone and Chamber of Secrets in hardcover Dutch. That's very exciting. So now we have a complete set of hardcover and paperback Dutch editions, the, the first editions. Uh, another big box for Ron. What is in here? Ah, in here it looks like we have the other Pottermore covers in Catalan. Here we have Goblet of Fire, Order of the Phoenix, Half-Blood Prince, Death Be Hallows, and Chamber of Secrets. Here are the other two Catalan paperbacks, Order of the Phoenix and Half-Blood Prince. This package I'm very excited about. This is from Luca in Albania. We did a trade. He had the first edition Albanian covers, the Mary Graham Prey American artwork covers. I have book one, but I needed the others. And he had, he's missing book five. So if anyone has Albanian in book five, Order of the Phoenix, with the American covers, the Mary Graham Prey covers, please let me know. Send me an email, thepottercollector at gmail.com, or leave a comment below if you have it and you are willing to sell it or trade it. But Lucas sent me the other six, and I traded him a full set of American editions. Here we have Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, first edition Albanian, Prisoner of Azkaban, Deathly Hallows, Sorcerer's or Philosopher's Stone. I already have it, so it will end up in a future Potter Collector Instagram book sale. Chamber of Secrets, and last but not least, Half-Blood Prince. So if you have Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix in Albanian with these covers, please let me know. I would love to get my hands on it and add it to the Potter Collector Library. All right, let's open the giant box that's left on this side. Giant box, Ron, not big box, Ron. This is a giant box for Ron. This is from uh, China. Oh, this is a box of goodies. <laughs> Oh, goodies after goodies after goodies. These are a fairly new release because they have the Wizarding World logo on the back of the box right here. The new, oh no, 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 these are not. That's the old Wizarding World logo. Never mind. scratch that, forget what I said. I forget what year these were produced. But look at that, it's got like a little carrying case. I'm gonna pop this open. <gasps> Holy mother of pearl! I forgot! <gasps> this is a special edition. This is like the deluxe edition, the new deluxe uh, uh, Chinese set. They're hardcover Pottermore books. <gasps> oh, look at this. Look at that. <gasps> oh, it's all of the books, all the books, and they are, ooh, they smell good too. Mm, fresh printed books. It's a really cool texture, um, nice gold gilding, uh, and the title itself and J.K. Rowling's name. Wow, these are beautiful books. Here's the Spine, Chamber, and Azkaban. This is like, I don't know how it is coming across on, on camera, but this is a really bright and colorful purple book. And this they, these are so colorful. Oh, I'm so excited if you cannot see from my reaction. Here's Goblet of Fire. Here's uh, Order of the Phoenix. I've never noticed this cover before. So here's Half-Blood Prince. Dumbledore uh, filling the cave with fire. And of course, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. 
right here. I actually purchased three of these sets, these Pottermore Chinese Special Edition sets. Two of them will be for sale in a future Potter Collector Instagram sale. You may be asking yourself why I purchase extra books to sell. It helps you get some rare or hard to find or unattainable books uh, for your collection. We also have Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets and Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. Here is Half-Blood Prince. All right, we have something from Casa del Libro in Spain. I was very excited to find this special edition Catalan set that I've been looking for for a while. And Casa del Libro had one left. This is, let's see, this should be Valencian. Yes, this is Valencian. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets in Valencian. It's brand new. <laughs> it's freaking brand new. Holy cow. It's hard to find these books used, let alone new. Oh my goodness, it's it's still wrapped. I purchased this because there was a seller on Casa del Libro who had Valencian Chamber of Secrets, so I snatched it up. It's brand new! I already have this book, but again, it's gonna be in a future sale. Or I may trade it to someone who needs uh, that book and there's, they have something that I need. Also brand new, a brand new copy of Georgian in hardcover of Chamber of Secrets. All seven of the Georgian editions are hard to come by. If my edition is not as nice as this one, I'll swap it out, but brand new Georgian. All right, let's take a look at this set of Catalan special editions, books one through four. Check this out. They mimic the deluxe editions, the deluxe cloth bound editions by Bloomsbury that they released. And this set is also brand new. I lucked out with this order. And they are also cloth bound. So I wonder if they just took the same design or if they, they're pretty much exactly the same, just in Catalan. And except that the edges aren't gilded as much as the British editions, but here are the books. You're gonna recognize them right away if you know what the UK editions look like, but here they are in Catalan. How cool is that? This is an edition I've been looking for for a very long time. You can find them on various used bookstores, Spanish bookstores or Catalan bookstores, but they are in horrible condition. These are brand new, unread, unopened with the box, the boxed set. Here is the side. Here is another side and the back of the box itself. These are lush, lush books. They also have the cloth bookmark that we see in the UK deluxe editions. Here is Chamber of Secrets. The picture is nice and smooth. Goblet of Fire and Prisoner of Azkaban. I don't know when these were published. 2001, this edition was published in 2001. And this is actually a first edition, a first edition, first printing of this book. Let's check the other ones real quick. As is Goblet of Fire, so I'm gonna guess that all of them are first printings. I don't know if they did other printings after the first. Yep, this is also first. October of 2001 is when these were published. And Philosopher's Stone is also a first edition. So my guess is that they did not release these separate from the box set. And from knowing about other translation special editions, they probably only did one printing of this set. Here they are inside of the box. And these are gonna look really beautiful on the shelves and add a nice pop color. Three boxes left, three big boxes. This is from my friend Carolina in Poland. She is also a Harry Potter book collector. Carolina helped me find two of the editions that I did not have in Polish. We have Prisoner of Azkaban, hardcover in Polish. A gorgeous copy of Sorcerer's Stone in Polish, hardcover. I have all of the paperbacks, but I needed the hardcovers. Chamber of Secrets, Order of the Phoenix, Goblet of Fire. Deathly Hollows and Half Blood Prince. Thank you, Carolina, for helping me get the hardcovers of the first editions in Polish, as well as the seven book box set adult editions in Polish. And these are brand spanking new. Chamber of Secrets, Azkaban, Goblet of Fire, a very thick Order of the Phoenix. This is a really big book. Half Blood Prince, and of course, Deathly Hollows. This one is also from China. They sent it in two boxes, the same order in two boxes. And we have the other paperbacks with the Kazu artwork, Goblet of Fire, and we have Prisoner of Azkaban, and Order of the Phoenix. So we have all seven of these paperback editions. And also from that Chinese order, 
we have a boxed set with the Johnny Duddle cover artwork. Forget what this set was called, but it had a special name to it. But I will show you the first book. It is the Johnny Duddle cover art. All right, we have come to the last box, the final box of this massive Harry Potter book unboxing. This is the set in Slovenian, which features the artwork by Johnny Duddle. What's very cool is they used the same box design that we get these books in the hardcovers of these books in the UK edition. And then also I purchased the boxed set of checkbooks in paperback. Checkbooks, not like checkbooks you write a check, but check from checklist is the box set in paperback to show you Philosopher's Stone. It's not a nice looking book. It's a beautiful, beautiful book. So this is the paperback edition in Czech. So that's it. All of the books have been unboxed. There is a huge pile of books that have to be put on shelves. This was really, really fun. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for watching, sticking around and watching me unbox a bunch of Harry Potter books. So many books. Look at all those books. And look at all of those boxes. If you have any questions about Harry Potter, Harry Potter collecting, or anything else, please feel free to leave a comment down below. You can also email me, thepottercollector at gmail.com, or send me a message on Instagram at thepottercollector. Now it is time to like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, keep collecting! Thank you so much for watching. If you're new here, welcome. You can subscribe right up here. You can also look at some previously posted content down here. If you have any questions about Harry Potter books or collecting, please feel free to contact me. I'm always happy to help. But for now, I must go. See you next time. Whoa, where'd he go? Prisoner of Azkaban. No, this is Deathly Hallows.